We're going to charge a metallic conductor from a high powered supply which is at almost 5000 volts. So a lot of charge on this metallic conductor and the theory says all the charge should reside on the outside. So what we're going to do is test it. We need a proof plane which is an insulated handle and this guy here is just a metallic conductor. So if there are charges on the outside, some of them will try and repel, they will try and repel each other. Some of them will move on to this guy here. I can transfer the charges from there onto my goalie for electroscope. The goalie for electroscope becomes charged and the legs should separate. So let's just test that. Discharge it to begin with. Make sure it's all insulated by putting a big uh, styrofoam base on the bottom. And we're going to start on the outside. You only need to tap it just for a second. So any electrons, which if there are a lot of electrons there, some of them will jump onto a proof plane over to here, touch it, and there we go. So you can show there definitely are charges on the outside. Let's do it two or three times just to magnify the effect. Let's go again, build up some more. Do it a second time, and a third time, discharge it. Over to here, one last time. And definitely charges on the outside of the conductor. So what I'm now going to try and see, discharge that guy and start again, and this time we'll look at the inside. So bring my proof plane to the inside, touch it there. Again, you only have to touch it for a second. Bring it over here and there should be nothing. Maybe it's very small, so let's go again, let's touch the bottom of it, all around the inside, over, and definitely nothing. And just for make it a fair experiment, let's do it three times, and you're getting no charges. So, no charge on the inside of a conductor, there are charges on the outside, it's a leaving cert demonstration, you must be able to be able to explain all the factors that's going on. This gullet is called a proof plane. <coughs> it's insulated here where I'm holding it, and this is just a metal disc. You know how the goalie for electroscope operates by itself. If you're demonstrating this, it's quite important, I think, to have a dehumidifier running in the background for a few hours in advance, <coughs> just to make the air very dry, so the charges don't discharge from here into the air while you're going from point A to point B. Okay, that's all there is to it. Sorry, thank you.